Welcome to English Story Time. Auntie K is here to read a book. What book will we read together? Come join me and have some fun. Hi there, everyone, and welcome to Young o Story Time. I'm Kristen Cho, but you can call me Auntie K. Kristen Nemo, 네 반가워요. All right, so happy to see you, and I have a new book today. Let's see the title. Around the world in 72 days. So we are going to talk about traveling, traveling around the world. Do you like to travel? I really like to travel. Let's see who this woman is. Let's start. Nellie Bly's challenge. Nellie Bly was born in the United States of America in 1864. She became a reporter. All right, let's take a look at this picture. Ah, there she is. What is her name? Nellie Bly. And what did she do? Ah, huh, she was a reporter. 네, a reporter. 기자죠, right? You write for a newspaper. And this was in 1864, so it's a long time ago. Let's read more about Nellie Bly. In Nellie's time, travel was tricky and slow. Yes, in 1864, at that time, a long, long time ago, traveling was tricky and slow. So tricky meaning it was difficult, hard, and slow, you know what that means. 빨리 가는 게 아니라 좀 느렸죠. 좀 복잡하고 힘들고 여행이라는 거는 쉽지가 않았어요. Let's look at this picture. Ah, what do you see? I see a steam train. Yes, a long time ago, they had steam trains. And they had all the steam come out. And do you see cars? No, I don't see cars, I see horse carriages. So this is a very different time from now. Let's move on. Nellie read a story in which a man traveled around the world in 80 days. She challenged herself to complete this trip in 70 days in a real life adventure. Wow, this is a big map. And it's about a man who traveled around the world in 80 days. 80일 안에 세계 일주 여행을 한 거예요, 한 남자가. And so, Nellie Bly said, wait a second, I can do that. I can do the same thing. I can do it faster. She said, I could do it in 70 days. Wow, she challenged herself. If you challenge, 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 이런 단어 많이 들리죠? Challenge. In English, challenge means 도전. So she challenged herself. 스스로 도전을 한 거예요. 나할수 있어. I'm going to try it. Wow, what a brave woman to go on this adventure. Let's read on. Departure. Nellie's boss said she needed a chaperone, a person joining her to keep her safe. But Nellie went alone. She just took a little lightweight satchel. When you go to the airport, you see this word departure. 네, 딱 사인이 보이죠? 그거는 출발이죠. So, for Nellie Bly, her departure, what happened? She wanted to go, and her boss, 상사죠, she says, oh, no, 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 you can't go by yourself. You have to take someone. And this person is a chaperone. 뭐, 보호자를 같이 가야지. 혼자 가면 안 돼. 그러니까, she says, no, it's okay. I can go alone. Wow, that's pretty brave. Okay, so she's going on alone. Let's move on. 
Nellie's departure was at 9.40 a.m. on 14th November, 1889. The adventure began on a steamship. There were no planes. All right, as we can see, she is ready to go. She is ready to depart. And what does she ride? See the picture? A steamship, chungi pejo. Right, steamship. She would have to take boats and she would have to take trains for her travel. So we're gonna stop here. We learned about Nellie Bly. She is going to travel around the world. Wow, that's a long trip. We'll find out more about her adventures next time. Now, let's do a little review. The first sentence is, she challenged herself to complete this trip in 70 days in a real life adventure. She challenged herself to complete this trip in 70 days in a real life adventure. So the word challenge is tojon. Now you can use it as a verb to challenge yourself. 도전을 하다. So, wow, 이런 정말 현실적인 몸을 도전을 한 거죠. That's very brave of her. So we can say something like, I like to challenge myself. 나는 이렇게 도전하는 걸 좋아해. 네. So I made a sentence and let's practice that sentence. Repeat after me. I like to challenge myself. A little faster. I like to challenge myself. Yes. Good job. Yeah. Next sentence. The adventure began on a steamship. The adventure began on a steamship. So the word that we want to focus on is adventure. Adventure. Mumiel. Right. Traveling can be a great adventure. Auntie Kay loves adventure travel. Let's practice that sentence. The adventure began on a steamship. The adventure began on a steamship. Oh, good job, everyone. So that's it for today. Ah, it's all about traveling and traveling around the world. How exciting and maybe a little dangerous. Let's see what happens next time. Please join me again. Meanwhile, take care. Bye.